Eight-year-old Maddie Major doesn't look sick at all, but this week her leukemia came back for the fourth time. You wouldn't even know she had cancer, honestly. I mean, on her worst day, she's still smiling. Maddie is so self-assured, she has no problem scolding her five older brothers and sisters. How do you not like cookies? When she relapsed a couple days ago, her mom started crying, and she looked at her mom, and she was just like, why are you worrying? I hate when people cry. Her mother, Robin Major, has reason to cry. The clinical trial Maddie now needs cannot be approved by the FDA because the FDA is shut down with the rest of the federal government. Look at this, Maddie. I am completely blown away by how callous and how carelessly they've just kind of used us as their pawns to push their own agenda. Robin says Maddie's cancer, pre-B-cell ALL, is curable in 90% of the cases. Her daughter's is in that 10% category. Traditional treatment like chemotherapy has not worked. For Maddie, this is truly life or death. You know, this isn't a game. This isn't, this isn't pushing one ideology over another. This is my baby's life. Six months ago, Maddie went through a clinical trial that worked, but because of her relapse, she's scheduled to have it again at a higher dose. Now it's all up in the air. It doesn't just affect people in their jobs. It affects children trying to survive. So while they act like children, they should take a cue from my child and act like her because she is eight, but she's showing maturity way beyond any of them. How would you get adults who can't get along to get along? Love. My only answer is love. In Waldorf, Peggy Fox, WUSA 9.